Hi, for today's video, I'm going to review the Jeffree Star Concealer. Hi YouTube, how are you guys doing? It's Marmar Snatch. So I'm back again for another video. In today's video, I'm going to do a first impression and review of the Jeffree Star Concealer. So yeah, I'm very excited to get these. I've been waiting for this. Unfortunately, I didn't get the powder because I already have a lot of loose powders right now. And uh, for today's review, I'm just only going to do the Jeffree Star Concealer. And I only got one shade. I got the shade C13. And let me take it out of the box. So, instead of me ordering the concealer online, I had to go to the Morphe store at the mall near my house. And the line was, well, the line was long, but not that long. So, I only had to wait for like 10 minutes or something. So, and then I asked the sales associate to swatch my, um, to swatch my concealer shade. So... I ended up using the C13 shade. So it has a... First of all, let me talk about the packaging. It's so like unique. It's like an artwork. It's like... It has a Sailor Moonish vibe to it. So that's one of the reasons why I have to get it too. Because of this one. It looks like a wand. Like like this. Like... Psh, psh, psh. And I haven't used this concealer yet. I just got it at the store today. So I've been out since... Uh... 10 a.m. That's why I look kind of like messy and oily right now. So, and I just took it out of the box. So this is going to be like a very, very new first impression. So let me check it right now. It has the applicator to it. You see it? There you go. So let me do it right now. I usually use a concealer under my eyes and my beard area. So there you go. Let me get closer to the camera so you guys can see it. This is actually the neutral shade um concealer. I was gonna choose the olive one. The one's kind of like darker than than my skin tone, but no, it was just too dark for me, so I chose this one. And usually for under my eyes, I like it brighter. Get a mirror. The concealer looks good, it blends in really well. So it doesn't look patchy, it's creamy, so it's not over drying either. So now let me check in my beer area. Let me do it over here. So far, I like the concealer, so. Okay. I was planning to buy like at least three Jeffree Star concealer, but I just decided to get only one because I still have a lot of concealers in my kit, so. So I just wanted to get one and test how it is and just to see like and showcase it to you guys like how how the concealer blends well to my skin and I'm already wearing a foundation on top because uh I went out today so Let me test it over here for my acne scars.
Okay, so far I like it. So, it doesn't look bad. It does blend well to my skin. It doesn't feel drying, so it is creamy. So it's not that bad. But the only way for me to test this concealer is if I wear it like before I go to work, which is gonna be tonight, like around nine, uh, like around 11 p.m. and then test it how it wears until 7 a.m. So that's gonna be my true uh, review for this concealer. But so far, I'm just testing it right now in front of the camera just to see how it is, like if it blends well to my skin. I like it so far, so it's not that bad. And the price point, uh, 22 bucks is, um, it's like a medium range um, price, so like almost close to a luxury concealer, but it's not, it's not that bad, so. So, so far I like it. Uh, I'm gonna be real with you guys. The reason why I got it is because it looks like a, a magic wand and it has a Sailor Moon vibe to it and I'm a big fan of that anime. So, yeah, I got it. I got it because of that reason. I mean, function-wise and coverage, I like it. Uh, I mean, the only true test or review that I can do with this concealer is for me to wear it at work for at least eight hours tonight and then check in the mirror and to see if it's squeezing under my eyes or my lip area but so far i really like it and it's not that expensive it's 22 dollars so a typical concealer costs like around 24 to 32 bucks so yeah so uh and don't forget to subscribe to my channel just click the button below and then uh follow me on instagram my username is marmar snatch and on twitter too as well my username is marmar snatch and thank you and have a good day. Bye.